Hey YouTube, this is Everything Epan here, and today I'm going to be doing a video tutorial on how to install Windows 2.11 in VirtualBox or VMware. Um, what this is going to be is I'm just going to be giving you guys the virtual hard drive. I will include a link in the description as well for the floppies, but this is just for the um, VHD, um, and I made it a lot easier for you guys to do this, but I will include the floppies in the description in case you guys want them. But let's just go ahead and get straight into it. Um, so what you're going to do is you're going to hit, um, let me go ahead and I'm going to save this real quick to a different specified location. So I got that moved. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to create a new machine and then call it Windows 2.11. Make sure the version is selected as Windows 3.1. Hit next. Hit next. Create or not create. Hit cancel. Hit use an existing virtual hard disk and then browse for the hard disk which should be found um, in the link in the description. Um, mine is specified right here. should be a virtual disk image. Hit open and go ahead and hit create. And then go ahead and start the machine. <coughs> So it'll start MS-DOS because I had to install MS-DOS before this and then all you have to do is type in win and it will and if this memory configuration thing comes up just hit OK and then there's only going to be a few programs located here but what you want to do is just double click Windows to ac access all the uh, Windows um, programs like the writing um, thing and everything but if you go to this menu button here and then or not the menu button hit file and then about MS-DOS Executive, it'll say Microsoft Windows MS-DOS Executive version 2.11, copyright 1989. So there you go. That confirms that it's version 2.11, and that's how to uh, install or kind of use or whatever you want to call it. Um, install Windows 2.11 in VirtualBox or VMware. This is one of those quick tutorials, but thank you guys for watching. Um, please uh, let me know in the description um, if I should separate my videos from now on. Um, if I should separate them from VirtualBox slash VMware to their separate categories. So like if I should do like, say I do an installation on VirtualBox, that should only be a VirtualBox tutorial. Or if I do a installation on VMware, that should be on an only VMware tutorial because it could get confusing for some people. But um, just let me know if I should separate the two in the description or not, or if I should keep them together. Whatever you guys think, just let me know in the description. So... Um, Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed, comment ideas down below, share the video as well, and don't forget to subscribe. Once again, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.